Hi viewers welcome to Dr Vijay's lectures on accounting lecture number 8 how to do ledger posting from special journals from cash book for cash transactions from trade day books for credit transactions in goods from journal proper for the residual transactions and non transaction entries the third one ledger posting from journal proper is familiar to you all however it is explained in brief at first then we proceed to ledger posting of cash book and trade journals in very detail thank you for your participation till the end please note that from next lecture onwards we are proceeding to rectification of errors reconciliation of cash book bank balance and passbook bank balance and preparation of final accounts and balance sheet this lecture provides the foundation for such further studies so your serious interest and attention to this lecture is very very important how to post a opening entry to ledger account is familiar to you in accounts to be debited post in the debit side with the caption to balance brought down and in the accounts to be credited post on the credit side with the caption in particular column by balance brought down an important aspect to be noted is cash balance and bank balance are to be shown in the cash and bank columns respectively in the cash book even though cash book is journal here in this case okay in cash account to be said in cash column to be said of cash book to balance brought down 6000 and in bank column to be said to balance brought down 12000 where the bank account is overdrawn then the opening balance will come on the credit side as by balance brought down in this case it is not overdraft so it comes in the debit side for the residual transactions are to be posted in the ledger like any other journal entry here three residual transactions are journalized so they should be posted as usual first one furniture and fittings account debit to mother interiors to be posted in debit side of furniture and fittings account and the credit side of mother interiors account second is drawings account debit to purchases to be posted in debit side of drawings account and the credit side of purchases account the third one rajan company related discount received this be posted in the debit side of rajan company and the credit side of discount received account slide 4 gives explanation regarding ledger posting from cash book please look at the slide carefully where a firm maintains a cash book as journal there is no need of maintaining cash account and bank account in the ledger book so cash book is journal as well as part of the ledger book for each entry in the cash book there is only one posting in the ledger book read that sentence once again for each entry in the cash book there is only one posting in the ledger book for each entry in the debit side of the cash book posting is to be given on the credit side of the relevant ledger account for each entry in the credit side of the cash book posting is to be given in the debit side of the relevant ledger account now regarding the discount columns of the cash book the periodic total period total means normally we close the cash book and find out the balance once in a week or once in a month or so depending on the number of transactions in the firm the periodic total for the period of the discount columns on both the sides total of the discount column in debit side should be posted in the debit side of discount allowed account the periodic total of discount column on the credit side of the cash book is to be posted on the credit side of discount received account now look at the last paragraph in case of deposits from cash to bank and withdrawals from bank account to firm's cash 
both the postings occur in the cash book itself and so no posting to be done in the ledger book such entries are marked to see in the folio column in the cash book remember where cash is deposited from cash box to bank account we know it is to be posted in the uh, bank column debit side and cash column credit side both in two entries in the cash book so we close the ledger folio column with c mark similarly where cash is withdrawn from bank to cash in the cash book we post in debit side of cash uh, debit side cash column and credit side bank column and we close the folio column with c mark so for contra entries there is no posting from cash book to any ledger account i will explain all the th things once again the opening balances in the cash book uh, cash column as well as bank column for that there is no posting in any ledger account because it is brought down from the previous period now for postings in the debit side of the cash book we know all receipts receipts are recorded in the debit side of the cash book and payments are recorded in the credit side of the cash book for entry all entries in the debit side of the cash book each for each entry in the debit side of the cash book there is only one posting in the ledger account on the credit side of relevant ledger account for each entry in the credit side of cash book there is only only one entry in the ledger book in the in the debit side of relevant ledger account for contra entries there is no posting in any ledger account regarding the discount column the total of the discount column in the debit side of cash book is to be posted in the debit side of discount allowed account the total of the discount column on the credit side of cash book is to be posted on the discount received account credit side okay now let us see how to do posting from cash book of sabu's firm for january 2020 look at the debit side of cash book first posting january 1 to balance brought down in cash column 6000 bank column 12000 this is the opening balance brought down from previous period we know there is no posting for this opening balance in any ledger account second item debit side january 72 sales in bank column 70000 in sales account it should be posted on the credit side by bank 70000 the third is compound entry there is c mark compound entry has no posting in ledger book next is January 12 to capital cash column 20000 in capital account should be posted on credit side by cash 20000 next is January 14 to roll in in discount column 300 cash column 19000 it has to be posted in roll in account on credit side two postings will come by cash 19000 by discount allowed 300 the next one is contra entry no posting in ledger account on january 25 next one to miranda in discount column 500 cash column 21500 to be posted in miranda account on the credit side as by cash 21500 by discount 500 what is shown next is the closing balance balance on january 31st carried down in bank column 9700 means in bank column credit side totally is more so carried down is shown debit side not to make both total is equal now on the credit side january 8 by cash contra entry no posting ledger then uh, by wages in cash column 300 to be posted in wages account debit side to cash 300 next one in salary account debit side to cash sorry to bank 8000 next one in drawing account debit side to bank 1200 next is in mother idd account debit side to bank 14500 and to discount received 500 next is contra entry no posting in ledger book now next january 16 in rent due account debit side to bank 9000 next in purchase account debit side to bank 32000 again in purchase account debit side to bank 41000 then in joy trader account to bank 22 20000 
in commission account deficit to cash 3000 in interest paid deficit to cash 2250 drawing account deficit to cash 5000 local taxes deficit to cash 2000 now the balance carried is shown in cash column that means in cash deficit total is more so shortage is shown on credit side to make both sides equal now an important thing to be noted is how to do posting from discount columns see look at the discount column in deficit total is 800 this has to be posted in discount allowed account in the ledger in deficit itself to sundry 800 in discount allowed account deficit itself to sundry 800 and discount column on the credit side of cash book shows 500 it is to be shown discount received account credit side itself by sundries 500 discount received account credit side itself by sundries 500 okay slide 6 gives some explanation about how to do ledger posting from trade day books look at that carefully Periodic total of purchases day book is posted in the debit side of purchase account, and each purchase is posted under credit side of relevant suppliers account. See, we know uh, for every purchase, purchase account is to be debited. Here it is only credit purchases. Okay, so corresponding posting is to go to the relevant customers personal account. Here the total periodic total. our period is january for the whole month of january so we are uh, closing all the accounts on end of january so periodic total of credit purchases for the whole month of january you have to take it and post on the debit side of purchase account each entry is to be however posted in the credit side of the supplier account because that supplier is our giver isn't it? to be credited now just the opposite of this for returns outwards or purchases returns periodic total of returns outwards book or purchase returns book to be posted on the credit side of uh, returns outwards account or purchases returns account and each entry to be posted in the debit side of the supplier's personal account because when we are returning goods to them they are receiver so it will be posted in the debit side now regarding sales credit sales in sales day book only credit sale of goods come periodic total of sales day book is to be posted in the credit side of sales account always sales account to be credited for every sale is it so this periodic total monthly total of january credit sales to be shown the credit side of sales account instead of showing each sales separately the only total we are posting there think how much labor can be saved now each part each sale is to be shown the debit side of the particular customer's account because that customer is receiver okay just the opposite of it to come in sales returns in returns inwards account or sales returns account periodic total of the sales returns is to be debited and for each sales return uh, the relevant customer's account to be credited okay read this once again please periodic total of purchases day book is posted in the debit side of purchases account each purchase is posted in the credit side of relevant suppliers account just the opposite of this in returns uh, periodic total of returns outwards book is posted on the credit side of returns outwards account each purchase return is posted in the debit side of relevant suppliers account periodic total of sales day book is posted in the credit side of sales account each sale is posted in the debit side of the relevant customer's account last periodic total of returns inwards book is posted in the debit side of returns inwards account and each sales return is posted in the credit side of the relevant customer's account okay slide 7 shows purchases day book and returns outwards book uh in purchase day book all credit purchase of goods are to be shown here there is only one credit purchase of goods during this period on january 6 from joy traders so that that only we can show okay the periodic total for the month is the same thing for 2000 this periodic total we have to show in the debit side of purchases account in the ledger book this is purchase day book in the ledger book there is purchase account in the debit side we have to show two sundries for 2000 the, and in the personal account we have to show on the credit side 
ஈச் பர்சன் அக்கோட் ஈச் சப்ளையர்ஸ் அக்கோட் இன் ஜோஜி ட்ரேடர்ஸ் அக்கௌண்ட் வியூ டு ஷோ அண்ட் அக்கௌண்ட் செட் பை பர்ச்சேசஸ் ஃபார் டு டூ தௌசண்ட் நவ் இன் ரிட்டர்ன்ஸ் அவுட்டோர்ட்ஸ் புக் இன் ஆல் இன் தேட் ஆல்சோ தேர் இஸ் ஓன்லி ஒன் பர்ச்சேஸ் ரிட்டர்ன்ஸ் டு ஜோஜி ட்ரேடர்ஸ் ஆன் ஜனவரி டு டுவெல் ஸோ ஓன்லி ஒன் போஸ்டிங் ஜனவரி டுவெல் டு ஜோஜி சாரி ஜோஜி ட்ரேடர் செவன் ஹண்ட்ரட் பீரியட் டோட்டலி செவன் ஹண்ட்ரட் செல்ஃப் தட் டோட்டல் வே டு ஷோ இன் பர்ச்சேஸ் ரிட்டர்ன்ஸ் அக்கௌண்ட் ஆர் ரிட்டர்ன்ஸ் அவுட்வர்ட்ஸ் அக்கௌண்ட் இன் தேட் வே டு ஷோ இன் த கிரெடிட் சைட் இன் ஜோஜி ட்ரேடர்ஸ் அக்கௌண்ட் வே டு ஷோ இன் த டெபிட் சைட் டு பர்ச்சேஸ் ரிட்டர்ன் செவன் ஹண்ட்ரட் ஓகே லெட் எஸ் சி ஹவு லெட் எ போஸ்டிங் இஸ் டு பி டன் ஃப்ரம் சேல்ஸ் டே புக் அண்ட் ரிட்டர்ன்ஸ் இன்வர்ட்ஸ் புக் ஹியர் வி ஹவ் சேல்ஸ் டே புக் in ledger book there is sales account here we have returns inverts book in ledger book there is returns inverts account the periodic total of sales day book is to be posted on the credit side of sales account here in the sales day book there are four credit sales the periodic total is 128100 this was to post on the credit side of sales account as by sundries each credit sale is to be posted in the debit side of the allowance and personal account in rollins account debit side 20200 james and company debit side 40000 etc in returns inverts book uh, there is two postings two entries total is periodic total is 1900 this periodic total we have to show in the debit side of returns inverts account or sales returns account in the debit side now each entry is to be posted on the credit side of the allowance and personal account in rolling account credit side uh, 900 by sales returns 900 james and company by sales returns 1000 okay when we are showing the totals posting the totals there the posting will be sundries because the total of all and when posting in loan personal account we show we can show whether sales are returns in words or uh, purchases what or it is now let us look at the ledger postings actually at the ledger book first is purchases account and joji traders account in purchase account debit side to sundries that is the posting from sale purchases day book the period total of purchases day book to sundries actually the date should be january 31st you show january 6 is shown here it's a mistake uh, total is taken at the end of the period so on january 31 now then two purchases from cash book that is cash purchases to bank the 2000 to bank 14000 on the credit side of purchase account there is goods taken by appropriate for personal use 500 by drawings by 100 this is purchase account see it's a purchase account is a normal account here in ledger posting we are not balancing normal accounts normal accounts balance we are not finding out balance you can find out in normal accounts easily because for expenditure accounts posting will be there only in debit side but rarely like drawing something will come on the credit side for a uh, income accounts posting will come only on the credit side we are not doing balancing of normal accounts drawing second capital account all the other accounts a real accounts and personal accounts are balanced let us look at joji traders account on credit side by purchases for 2000 in debit side goods returned by them 700 and we paid them 20000 to bank 20000 and the balance remaining payable is 19300 it is credit balance we should pay joji traders 19300 in slide 10 there is discount allowed account returns inverts account returns outward account discount allowed account there is a posting in debit side january 31st to sundry 800 the periodic total of cash book discount column debit side in returns inward account january 31st to sundry 1900 the periodic total of returns inverts book next is returns outwards account january 31st by sundry 700 this is a periodic total of 
returns outwards book posted okay in slide 11 there is commission paid account interest on loan account and local taxes account in commission paid account deficit january 1 to cash 3000 uh, from cash book credit side in cash book credit side there is january 21 by commission 3000 this is the corresponding posting next is interest on loan account january 25 to cash 2250 in cash book credit side there is by interest on loan cash column 2250 this is corresponding posting in interest on loan account to cash 2250 next is local taxes account uh, in cash book credit side there is on january 31 by cash sorry by lo uh, local taxes 2000 in cash column this is corresponding posting in local tax account january 31 to cash 2000 in slide 12 there is sales account and roll in account in sales account credit side january 7 by bank account 78000 the corresponding posting is there in the cash book cash book deficit to sales in bank column 78000 is there this is the corresponding posting now next is on january 31 by sundries 1,28,100. See, this is the total of, periodic total of sales day book. In sales day book, the periodic total on January 31, 1,28,100, that is posted in sales account in credit side as by sundries 1,28,100. Next is roll in account. In debit side, there is January 6 to sales 20,200. Uh, the see the uh, goods sold to Rollins on credit. On credit side, there is January 31 by returns inverse 900. Then he gives cash by January 14, uh, 19,000 by cash 19,000 from cash book. Then January 14 by discount of 300, that also from cash book. The Rollins account is settling, it is closing. Okay. Slide 12, sorry, 13 deals with furniture and fittings account. Mada Interiors account, discount received account. Furniture account, fittings account and Mada Interiors account we have seen so many times. I am not going into the details of that now. Mada Interiors account is closing. It is settled. In furniture account, fittings account, there is a closing balance of 23,000 in deficit. Now discount received account, look at the credit side. January 24 by Rajan Company 100. It is from the non-transaction entries, sorry, uh, residual entries, general proper. Now, next is January 31 by sundries. That is a periodic total of cash book, credit side, discount column. In slide 14, there is Rajan Company account and capital account. These two accounts we have seen so many times, so we are not explaining now in detail. In slide 15, there is drawing second, salary second, and wages account. Drawing second, we have seen so many times. Now, salary second, deficit January 10 to bank 8000. The corresponding, it is from cash book credit side, where there is buy salaries in bank column 8000. Next is wages account. In deficit, there is to cash 300. This is also from cash book. Cash book credit side, there is by wages in cash column 300. In slide 16, there is Jameson Company account, Rent Due account, and Khan Brothers account. Jameson Company is a customer, there is posting in deficit, Jan 22 sales 40,000, that is from sales day book. On credit side, Jan 27 by returns inverse 1,000, that is from sales returns day book. Uh, the account is balanced on January 31st by balance card on 47,000 and brought down to deficit on February 1 to balance brought down 47,000. Next is rent due account. There is an opening balance due on January 1 on credit side by balance brought down 9,000. It is paid on February 16 in cash book credit side 
by rent due bank column 9000 here it is posted deficit january 16 to bank 9000 account closes can brothers account is also our customer uh, posting in sales day book uh, uh, corresponding posting here in can brothers account deficit january 22 to sales 45000 no other transaction, so balance is carried on on credit side and brought on to February 1 in debit side. Slide 7 is the last folio of ledger book. There is Miranda account, stock and rate account and loan from Asad bank account. Miranda account, Miranda is our customer, debtor, should pay 22,000 dirhams to us. So opening balance January 1st to balance brought down 22,000. On 25, Jan 25, they are paying 21,500 and we are losing a discount of 500. So on credit side, Jan 25, by cash 21,500, by discount allowed 500. This is from debit side of cash book. Now stock and trade account, there is opening balance 36,000, opening stock, no other posting, so that account remains as it is. We are not closing that account right now. Loan from Asad bank account, there is opening balance 14,000 due to them by our firm. It is not paid, so it remains as such to balance carried on 14,000 by balance brought on 14,000. Slide 18 is trial balance prepared from Sabu's firm as on 31st January on the basis of ledger, ledger balances prepared from special journals. Go back to the trial balance prepared for Sabu's firm on 1st Jan 31st, for 31st January. Uh, on the base of ledger accounts prepared from general journal. There won't be any difference between these two trial balances. All the accounts do show the same balance. This trial balance is tallying. So it is proof of arithmetical accuracy of the postings and recordings. This lecture comes to an end. Thank you for viewing till the end. Hope how to do ledger posting from special journals is clear to you. This is how journalizing and ledger posting is done in business firms, even where accounting is done through systems and not manually. Those who have not subscribed this lecture so far, please subscribe for getting all the uh, lectures in time. Please share to your friends who plans to join for plus one, plus two commerce, BCom, BBA, MBA, especially from non-commerce backgrounds, and those who want to join for CA, CS, CMA, preliminary examinations. Going through the lectures will give them strong foundations in their studies. The best gift you can give to such persons. Thank you.